Good evening, everyone. It is once again Ted the Speed Learner, and once again I'm going to improvise this video. Even though I'm running a live stream right now, I have my laptop right next to me, and there's just one thing I needed to look at while I was making this particular video. In a previous video, specifically in the Navigating My YouTube Channel 2020 video, I had mentioned, and I, did, I didn't just mention this um, in the laptop edition of the uh, Navigating My YouTube Channel, but also the desktop edition of my Navigating My YouTube Channel 2020 video, because I have two of them. Okay, actually I actually have three, but in two of them I actually mentioned this. On my main channel page, I have a community tab, but I also wanted you to focus on something else. When you first go on to YouTube, whether you're doing this from your smartphone or also from your laptop or desktop, you'll see a whole bunch of videos that are recommended to you, but if you scroll down just a little bit, you'll see something called Latest YouTube Posts. These come directly from the community tab on, well, see, I'm considered a YouTube creator, and since I have over a thousand subscribers, I have a community tab on my main channel page, and I can actually type up a message and send it from that community tab to every one of my subscribers. So you guys can get news from me, even though I'm not uploading a video at that time. So if you will look for latest YouTube posts, uh, you'll have to scroll down a little bit because you'll see a whole bunch of videos that are recommended to you. But if you scroll down just a little bit, you'll see a, a thing that says latest YouTube posts. Those posts are coming from the community tab of YouTube creators like myself. And you ought to check them out because sometimes the posts are very important. Just like a recent one I did where I specifically told everybody that I had changed the thumbnails on some of my videos and I've added actual descriptions to some of my videos that I had never added descriptions to before and this is important because you may not know that I ever did that unless I tell you so hopefully you will share this video around with everybody and if you ever get the community tab now you know how it works and what people are supposed to look for so that they can actually see what you've been up to. Because they may not know about this latest YouTube post part of their, their channel page, and they may also not know that your channel, like mine, has a community tab. And like I said, if you have over a thousand subscribers, they award you the community tab, which then you can transmit a message to every one of your subscribers. Right now I have over 1,900 people and therefore I'm able to transmit a single message to all of them all at once. So please share this video with all of your subscribers and let them know that that's how that works because they may not know. Alright, I will tell you more in a future video so I'd like for you to stay tuned.